I need good morning. We're doing take two, Joella May, day 41 of my 60 day guided meditation commitment inspired by Dr. Joe Dispenza. So, um, yeah, I got a phone call and I interrupted the video. So, take two, try to remember what I said before because I don't know how to splice it together. Um, yeah, you missed the lighting of the candling part. Mm -hmm. Aww. Anyway, so I was getting to this candle, as you can see, it's an orange candle. I found it ironic that I picked the orange candle because while I was looking through the box, I had my eyes closed trying to feel the energy of which one was the warmest candle for me to pick out. And it was orange. <clears throat> that represents the sacral chakra, which is also ironic to one of the um, <coughs> meditations I picked out. My throat is all clogged up. Where's my morning drink? <sighs> oh. oh yeah, I haven't done my other stuff yet. So last night's video was a hypnosis video. It was a different one than the one I used before. I think this was like 11 hour video or something. I don't know. But I think I slept for the first six hours. And then I went to the bathroom. And then I just lied here listening to it for another two hours. Like, couldn't fall asleep, but I didn't want to get up. <laughs> so I was listening to the meditation. So I think I was about six and a half hours in. When I turned it off, I started looking for another meditation. And um, I'm trying to get a full one in here. That was one or two. Crap. I don't remember. <laughs> this is two or three. Let's say it's two. Because it's not that strong in my mouth yet. I'll know on the playback. <laughs> mm. Brandy taste. The label goes all the way around so I can't tell, but it feels like I've already used half of the bottle. I'll have to go back out and it's got done to see if I need to get more. <laughs> so that was two, so we'll officially say this is three. Yeah, the dropper's not filling up, so I think I might do a fifth one. So, when I was looking for this morning's video, um, there was this other video that said watch for 10 days every day for three times a day. And I was like, okay, thinking it was a meditation video. It was only a meditation video. Ugh. Holly. Uh. Oh, certainly won't cough anymore after putting all that branding in. Ugh. First thing in the morning. Um, so yeah. So the first one I watched, it was wasn't that long. It was only like maybe 10 or 15 minutes. I don't know. Ugh. Make my nose run. Ugh. Mm. Paint, probably. Anyway. <clears throat> so the second video is like 10 or 15 minutes long, I think. Maybe close to, I don't know. The link will be in the description box, but it basically is um, like an explanation or a reiteration of why we do these meditations. So that's why I put the link in there because it was really cool and I'm definitely going to have to throw it on here and there throughout the day to remind myself and um, yeah, 
once I finish my 60 day guided meditation, um, and with these last 19 days, I'm going to diversify my meditations a little more intensely and, um, what he explained and how they do the group meditations and in the mornings and the evenings. And I remember when, um, a friend of mine was first, um, awakening and she was getting into this group and they were doing these morning and evening prayer meditations, healing meditations. And like, she wasn't getting into it with me cause she was too excited and she had to go do it for herself and all that. And she didn't know how to explain it at the time. Now she's like all into it, but you know, states away. So hopefully I'll get there this summer working on it. Projects in life, uh, emotional, um, grounding, grounding is really hard for me. Um, so I did find a meditation video it was different than I've done. It was for pineal gland. It was specifically in, um, meditation, pineal gland, morning guided activation meditation, breathing, respiration. So the reason why I said that the uh, orange candle was funny was because um, with this particular meditation, he starts from digestion all the way up to take you through. <clears throat> and I specifically say digestion, which is sacral. <laughs> That's why I thought it was funny. Um, so that would have been naturally the color to pick, but I wasn't thinking. I just closed my eyes and let my hand pick it. <laughs> so that wasn't the first take but since i don't know how to splice it together maybe later i'll figure it out if i do then i'll redo the video if i don't erase the first one because i noticed i'm using up a lot of memory with these videos so now that they're all uploaded on facebook hopefully that means i don't have to keep them on my phone anymore i don't know we'll see uh, i gotta figure all that out i don't know how that works yeah <laughs> yeah so, <clears throat> this morning's video is the pineal gland video. Twenty-three minutes long. Um, there's one part I think in the last twenty minutes where it's where the music stops for three seconds, and you think it's about to cut off, and it doesn't. It goes a little bit further, and then his voice comes in. So, yeah, because um, I like I fidgeted. It when it went quiet for a couple of seconds because it confused me because I thought it ended you know because sometimes they just end but no he's still there so just stay in that second those few seconds oh good morning <laughs> um in that moment don't think it's over because mm -hmm. I'll guide you out Still can't get used to the lemon stevia. Trying. Trying that open ended word again that I wanted to take out of my vocabulary. But I guess it's fitting because I'm not really doing anything to make me like it more. I'm just going through the process of drinking it. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> so I got really good sleep with the meditation last night and I do have all my links copied this time so I'll be able to put all three in the description box um back to the second one the one that was more the reiteration kind of explanation it also entered oh I did say that about the morning and night meditations already duh uh, I was almost thinking it was in the first take, but I didn't get that far. <laughs> I'm such a goof. I love being goofy. Yeah, so I wanted to make this a short video. I think that's why I'm not too focused.
Oh, yeah, still waking up. Um, yeah, so we did the hypnosis one, and then we went into the explanation, and then the pineal gland. What was really nice about the pineal gland video was even though he was doing the guided, his voice was so soft and nurturing in this one that it just like, I felt like there was a blanket over me of extra love. If that makes sense. Um, yeah, because sometimes his voice can carry in that heavy echo and it's a little like intense, I guess. I don't know how to describe it. It was different. But in this one, it was very like soft and fluid and like it went in the music. So it, um, <clears throat> it just felt like a blanket of love coming around you as he was talking so that's why I say I felt in a very nourishing nurturing <laughs> nourishing nourishing nurturing kind of thing which was really cool mm -hmm. that's that's about the easiest thing I can use to describe it I mean other than you know it's for specifically for you to learn how to open up your pineal gland which is the whole focus of medit the of his guided meditations I won't say of meditation in general just his guided I mean yeah but you know everything is how you put your intention with any different meditation like after I finished my 60 day guided meditation with him, I'm going to explore other types of um, guided meditations and things. So I have um, him as my base comparison, if that makes sense. Um, and I think, I think going through this meditation process, uh, I think it's um, vital that we all learn how to go through a meditation process and you know i can understand some people getting intimidated or overwhelmed when they're first looking at a stuff because there's so much of it <clears throat> that's part of the reasons why i like doing these videos or vlogs video blog um is because I get different things out of each different guided kind of meditation. That's why I like to try to do a different one each time. <clears throat> I don't like sticking with the same one, but sometimes when I um, can't find another one, I'll go back to that one just because I'm in a rush of, for that day. So I don't want to do that rush feeling anymore like this morning when I sat there and like scrolled through okay which one am I gonna do and then I found the one on pineal and I was like oh this is really neat and then after I played it after I watched it um and I was trying to scroll through my phone to match it up so I could copy the link um then I saw another one for pineal that was like an hour and something long so I'm interested to do that one next. Will I do that one after this one? Maybe. Will I do it tomorrow? Maybe. I'm not making any commitment in either which way. I know it, it caught my eye and caught my attention. So we'll see how much it stays resonated with me if I pick it back up or not. Um, after it, this video finishes loading, I'll probably watch that that uh, second video again with the explanation because like it said on the thing watch it three times a day or more for 10 days so <clears throat> and for how much it hit me emotionally uh yeah it was nice to hear again because it was kind of like an encouraging reassurance of why I'm doing these meditation practices you know even though I'm not doing it in his group or in a group or groupings of people, um, I still can feel an intense energy work. I um, did, back in my 20s, I went to a very amazing um, seminar. It was called, it was uh, EOB, Essence of Being. Um, Burge, she um, um, created it with a couple others. 
um, but mainly her, um, over everything that she has an amazing family and I was in 20 years ago before I conceived my son I was very into going and wanting to be part of that foundation my husband didn't my first husband didn't um, connect with them so it was yeah so anyway <laughs> um but they're always there for me. I've reached out to her over the years, but the, she lives in Georgia, so it's not as easy for me to get around. They still have their seminars all over the place. There's someone in North Carolina, but I think they're over four hours away from me. I haven't reached out to them yet again recently. Um, now that I'm talking about it, who knows? Maybe I will. <laughs> You know, it's how the universe works in those idiosyncrasies when we start discussing things. That's another thing why I love these vlogs, because I can go back and look and see my own self-reflections, whether you like, whether I get, uh, bleh, whether I get a large following or not. These benefit me in my experience, because my own my future will be documented my present is documented um i kind of always wanted more daily documentation throughout my life going off on a tangent uh, it was a strange thing um that i would think about but yeah we'll make a different video on that another day <laughs> It will be interesting when I do learn how to edit and all that other stuff if I go back to these videos or if I just leave them alone. I don't know. We'll see. Life is interesting. That is for sure. But no. And with that, I am going to say I love you. And you have an amazing grand rising, you beautiful soul. Every day is a new experience. Enjoy it. It's here for you. It's you. Create it. <laughs>